Hey guys, what's up? This is Place the Moonfin and I'm here with my friend, Mr. Knight. So, how are you doing? Oh, quite uh, well today, thank you, Blaze. Yeah, anyway, today we are going to talk about the recent Channel Aversome drama. Now, before I give my personal opinion on what has been happening, I think my friend should give his opinion first. Go ahead. Well, personally, it's all quite night and uh, how should I say this? It's it's quite, it's quite uh, disappointing to hear that it's come to this. Uh, yes, that all all that all this drama is happening. Mm. It's uh, I'm trying to find the words for it. So basically, what happened is that the management of Channel Arsenal has been screwing over a lot of people. Particularly the, with its CEO, Mike Machard. Yeah, you know what to say? Don't you like looking up his name? I'm just gonna call him Mike. Yeah, Mike is a cunt. There is no getting around it. See, that's quite very apt. Yeah, he is a cunt for sure. What he has done to this site is disgusting. And basically everyone on there are like his slaves to him, including the walkers. Yeah, now I did read the document and there's one thing that really shocked me and that's the fact that the character of the nostalgia critic doesn't belong to Doug Walker and that is very messed up because Doug Walker is the one who fucking made that character. Imagine, oh, with his brother Rob. Yeah, imagine if I didn't have the rights to my internet personal place to move and that would be, that would be pretty messed up. Indeed. Somehow, uh, he owns the legal rights to the Nostalgia Critic character. How he got that? I'm not entirely sure. I don't know the full details behind that, but he owns it. Uh, yeah. He's been the CEO of, of Channel Awesome since Bargov, of whom many viewers might remember as Mati in, uh, in uh, the Critic's earlier reviews, who yeah. uh, retired. Yeah, anyway, there is one thing that I want to say. If, if what I read in the document, by the way, I linked with this in the video, is accurate. Doug Walker is also to blame for some of the bad shit that happened at fucking Channel Armstrong. There's no denying that, but however, uh, there are a lot of it, to, it I, I'd say comes off, uh, at least a fraction of it must come off, as, it came off to me as from, <clears throat> as, uh, from naivety, a possible ignorance, not so, rather than cruel or vindictive intentions. Yeah. Alright. Now, someone might be wondering if I'm still going to support the Nostalgia show after this. Well, my answer to that is yes. Even though something terrible has happened the channel some it doesn't change the fact though that the Nostalgia Critic is my favorite movie reviewer on the internet. So I am still going to support the Nostalgia Critic show so I think it's fucking awesome. How about you? M m mostly the same, but... So I will, I'll, I'm never touching the official website ever again. Yeah, well, that's where I watch the Nostalgia Critic. I don't watch the Nostalgia Critic on YouTube. Also, to tell you the truth, I don't really watch many people on Channel Love so the, the Nostalgia Critic is the only one I watch. I don't watch Linkara, the Nostalgia Chief, or anyone else. The only people on Channel Love so that I watch besides the Nostalgia Critic are people with their own official YouTube channel like Angry Joe and Chris Stockman, but other than well, that, I only watch the Nostalgia Critic. Well, the Nostalgia Chick has not been part of Channel Awesome for a couple of years now. She's on YouTube on, under her real name, Lindsay Ellis. Oh, that's interesting. And Lycara left just a, a week or two before this mess came out, and and is oh. a, a, also on his own channel called uh, Roisu, which is the Japanese pronunciation of Lewis. Okay, correct me if I'm wrong, but he haven't Doug Walker and Linkara have been fucking friends for years. I thought they were. Yes, yes, they they are they they are, they are still friends to my knowledge. But think about Linkara left and he made a whole post on his website about it. I could link it in the chat if you want. Um, sure, well, sure, but I think we should wrap this video up. Anything final that you want to say before we end this video? I I got nothing else. I already said everything that I wanted to say about this. <sighs> Well, no, I've always I've suspected for years uh, uh, that uh, Mike Machado was a detestable sociopath. Uh, uh, hell, was uh, remember the Shadow Dark Town, the Shadow People from years ago? They they made a made a few jabs at him in one of their videos. It was back around 2015 uh, because yeah. he has 
Yeah, unfortunately, they have deleted that video since then. Well, uh, at least I think it's still up. Regardless, yes, uh, they they spoke of problems even back then. Just yeah. I always just. Yeah, suspected he, he was bad, bad at, uh, at being a manager, but this just puts a whole new new, sh new meaning to it, so to speak. Especially with his treatment of the of, of the death of Jim Wario. Yeah. Oh, there are a few other things that I want to say about that cunt Mike. It disgusts, it absolutely disgusts me how sexist he is. He only he doesn't care about anyone or anything but himself. I remember reading that back in the day, Lord Cat, who, when he was part of Channel Awesome, said he he, saw, he claimed he saw that Mike Machad uh, spent more time on Xbox Live than he did actually managing the site back when he was st uh, started. And yeah. given his apathy on towards the people's plights, I don't I don't say I say this I don't doubt it. Yeah. Okay, one more thing to say and then I'm gonna end the video. I didn't want to make this video. I really fucking didn't. But the reason why I made it is because it has to be made since I am after all a big fan of the nostalgia Greg. Well, th that's everything. To end the video here. I understand. What do you think? Do you want to end the video? Well, my final words, I hope that Dog and Rob can somehow shake free of the, of the chains that uh, that uh, Mike has put on. Um, I know he owns the rights to Nostalgia Critic character, but <sighs> I, I hope they can somehow uh, shake free of him someday. Yeah, alright. I have nothing else to add. Uh... I'd say that will do then. Alright, thank you guys for watching and you all have a fantastic day.